Okay, let's see how to use the TI calculator to find a um, parabola which passes through three given points. In other words, to find a quadratic function um, which fits uh, three data points. So, firstly, we need to go to stat. So, if you press stat, edit, you will see um, the lists into which we'll enter the points. We don't want to enter the points given here. So what I'm going to do is go to the top of the list and clear. Now it's important when you're clearing a list to press the clear button, not delete. If you press delete, all of L1 will disappear. So I go to L1 and press clear. And then press enter and the values are removed from L1. I'm going to do the same thing with L2. So go to the title bar of the list and press clear. And let's say our problem involves finding the relationship between speed and gas mileage. So we're given some speeds and some corresponding gas mileage figures. For instance, let's say that when we travel 30 miles an hour, the gas mileage is 22 miles per gallon. So we'll enter 30 into L1 and 22 into L2. So we'll continue by entering the speeds into the L1 list, which are, these will be our x values, and we'll enter the gas mileage into L2. And so these values will be in L2. So the speeds are 30 miles per hour, 50 miles per hour, and 70 miles per hour. And the corresponding gas mileages are 22 miles per gallon, 31 miles per gallon, and lastly, 19 miles per gallon. So, um, press enter. And now we're going to try to fit a quadratic curve to this. Um, to do this, we're going to press the stat key and scroll across to calc. Um, we're going to choose quadratic regression, in other words, number five, which is quad reg. Um, for now, let's understand regression to mean the process of uh, finding a curve to fit given points. So in this case, we want to find a quadratic curve to fit the points we just entered. So we press 5, and we press Enter, and the calculator performs the quadratic regression, and we'll see that the result is that gas mileage is negative 0 0.02625 times the speed squared plus 2.55 times the speed minus 30.875. The R squared equals 1 basically indicates that this curve is a perfect fit for our data points. One last thing. If we want to plot this curve now, um, there is something we can do here that's quite useful. If I clear the curves that I already have in the plot window to begin with. Um, we can paste the curve from the regression into um, the y equals window. And to do this, we go to VARS, so click on VARS. Um, so what sort of VARS or variables are we looking at? We're looking at something we've um, calculated using the statistics functions. So we'll choose number five, which is statistics. We want to paste an equation. So you can see across the top, we see EQ. So we'll scroll across to EQ. And obviously, we want to paste the regression equation. And this corresponds to the first option. So if we press Enter now, the regression equation will be pasted into the y equals um, window and all we'd have to do now is choose a suitable window for plotting the curve and that's it